This is many people's worst nightmare. A house full of horrors has transformed the Octagon Athenium's basement, all for giving residents the ultimate fright night. It's going to be an intensive experience, so it's going to be very full on and uh, very brutal for the customer to go through. Customers will be walking through the medical themed setup that's plagued with scary actors, mannequins, and toys. Foley's no stranger to this, having held events all around the country to raise more than $100,000 for charity. He's done it for the past five years for organisations like South Canterbury Cancer Society and Plunkett, as well as for sporting individuals. This time the money's going to Heart Kids Otago. I believe Heart Kids don't get any government funding, so the more that we got in, the better it would be. But, you know, um, they're very grateful for what they are about to receive, I guess you could say. The charity supports families of children with heart problems who are constantly going in and out of hospital. Local woman Angela Evans is one of several people receiving help from the organisation. Money raised locally will assist families like hers to be better looked after during their child's medical battle. It's an absolute privilege to have him here and I hope everybody gets behind this cause. It's wonderful. It's all these lovely little babies that have got a zipper down their chest and these very, very brave parents. The Horror House will be running on Friday and Saturday nights this weekend and next. For $25, punters can leave their hearts well and truly beating. Annabelle Dick, 39, Dunedin News.